Are you posting awesome and consistently great content on your stories, but your link clicks are not adding up for the amount of viewers that you have? Are you worried that Instagram switching from the swipe up feature to the link sticker will actually hurt you more in the long run? Don't worry, as always, I've got you covered. In today's video, we are gonna talk about some different ways that you can optimize your story content to get more link clicks and by extension, also get more valuable customers. Hi, and welcome back. If we have not met yet, I'm Shannon, and I am obsessed with helping small businesses and creative entrepreneurs build a community, create an impact, and grow their business by using social media. Also, huge announcement. I released my latest course, The Content Solution. So if you cannot find what you're looking for in any of these videos or in my Small Business Resource tab, by all means, feel free to click on the link below The Content Solution and see if it's a fit for you. Because if it is, I would love to work with you. And if it isn't, shoot me a DM or leave a comment below in what exactly you are looking for so that I can help serve you better. So let's talk about how Instagram is changing the game again, and this time it's with the link sticker. Again, if you do not have it, this will be a slow rollout. It is coming. Be patient. The link sticker is actually more customizable and makes it easier than ever to share links directly to your products or other link suggestions, which I talk about in the previous video that you can watch right here. This actually gives us a few advantages that you're probably not aware of. One of the biggest ones being the engagement factor. With a swipe up feature, your audience was not as likely to engage. They could only swipe up and then click and then have to like wind their way down to find the product. However, with the link sticker, if they wanna leave you a comment or a like, they can actually do that now because that space at the bottom is opened up. Along with tapping and engaging with the story by tapping on the link sticker itself. You can also strategically place the link sticker anywhere within your story, which adds a little bit of eye-catching drama and allows you to be a little more creative with how you place it. For instance, you can put your link sticker within the story and then you can add some text above the link sticker so it's hidden in your branded colors or your branded font or something very similar. And in that text option, you can be like, click here or for more info, tap here, or you can even do a tap your gift so that when the customer actually taps on that text, the link sticker is underneath of it. And so they'll be able to go to the link directly. Just a little bit more fun. When it comes to using the link sticker, you want to make sure that you warm your audience up. You can't just hit them with product, 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 link, 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 shop, shop, shop. It doesn't work that way. Nobody's gonna stick around for that. Get your audience used to engaging with your stories, used to engaging with you. Use the polls, use the quizzes, use all of the stickers that Instagram provides to make it an interactive experience for the user. Not only that, it's a great way to also get to know your customers and ask questions to figure out what they're really looking for. This ultimately helps you sell your products in the long run. You also wanna try to include variety in your Instagram stories. Not only do you wanna show short snippet videos, but you wanna show also clips of IGTVs, clips of lives, you wanna do photographs. You wanna make sure it's not the same thing over and over and over again. As I always say, you wanna to try to include a call to action. Click here, tap here. For more information, go here. Those are all call to actions. You're directing your audience on where to go and what you want them to do. People actually like to be told what to do. We have so many things in our face constantly and it's always going by so fast that if somebody tells us to do something, we're more than likely to engage with the story and click on it. While I know this next topic is not everyone's favorite thing to do and it's not mine either, get on stories, show your face, talk about your brand. People love to buy from people. People love to team up with businesses that share the same values, the same beliefs as you do. And also it's a great way to show behind the scenes and add a little bit of entertaining value as well. You wanna make sure you're always, always following the 80-20 rule. You do not wanna be selling 100% of the time. Yes, you can show your products or your art pieces, but make sure you're weaving in stories along within your captions or adding value in some type of way. Also, 
The 80-20 rule is what I abide by. 80% of the time add value and value does not have to be teaching or tutorials. Value can be anything that makes somebody smile or makes their life just a little bit easier. 20% of the time, that's when you wanna go in for the sell. Getting people to click on your link sticker will probably take a little bit of time as this new feature rolls out. There's bound to be glitches. People need to start to get used to this new feature. But by using some of these strategies that I just discussed, people are going to start engaging with you more on a regular basis within your stories. If you have any questions or if you think that I missed anything at all, please drop a comment. If you want to keep following me, be sure to hit that subscribe button and then also hit the like button as well. You can show up with me every Thursday morning at 9 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. If I haven't said it before, I just want to tell you thank you, thank you, thank you for being here and I really hope you enjoy this content. I really want to do things that will push the needle and drive your business forward. I also don't like wasting time, which is why most of these videos are not 20 minutes long. I am grateful for every one of you that are watching this. Until next time, I'll see you then.